Hey guys, it's Chris here, aka Apollo Fox, and welcome to my first ever Minecraft video. Yay! Uh, I was going to do one before, but I thought it would be best to wait until they released 1.8 proper, so I can demonstrate some of the new features as well, um, if I can come across them. Uh, be warned, I'm no genius at this game. Um, generally just tend to make a mess of everything, which, yeah, can be quite fun sometimes, um, but don't be expecting, you know, super builds or whatever, uh, but I hope you enjoy it anyway, um, so I'm going to go ahead and get started, um, that was my trial world when I was testing the pre-release, which was pretty awesome, if not a little buggy. Um, so I'm going to create a new world here and we shall call it... No. Let's play. There we go. And in 1.8 you can now get to select what game mode you want to play on, whether it's survival or creative. Um, so we're going to play on survival because it's much more fun for a let's play. Um, and I'm not going to put a seed in because, well, mainly because I don't really have any good ones, but also because it'll just be more fun, really, if I don't really know what's happening. Uh, and obviously we'll have the generate structures on, because in 1.8 they now have villages, dungeons, and strongholds, which is quite interesting. Um, the villages aren't populated at the moment. Apparently they're going to get populated in 1.9, but I don't know how true that's going to be. Um, okay, so that's us, and we shall go ahead now and create the world. There is a reason for the little jump there. Uh, I'm really not having any luck at all with the world generation here. Uh, first, it spawned me on a desert island with no land for ages and ages. Not even a tree. At all. Hopefully there'll be something nearby this time. Because um, last time it was a disaster. Uh, so this is third time lucky, anyway. Ah, so fingers crossed guys. Um, so, you know the drill with the let's play. Tree punching! Um, so while I collect some wood, I'm going to tell you a bit about myself. Um, as you can probably tell already by my accent, I am from Scotland. Um, yes, I have red hair. And yes, I do own a kilt. Just to get that out of the way nice and early. Um, yeah, so this is my first ever YouTube video in general. Just, I have no idea what I'm doing. Um, so, bear with me. Uh, so, should be interesting. Um, so, even if this one sucks, bear with me. I'll try and get it better. Um, okay, this will, after I finish this here, I'll be enough wood to be getting on with at the moment. Um, I'm just going to have to build my house. Brown sheep. In the swamp here. Um, so. First things first. Crafting table. Uh, and we shall put it. Where shall I build my house? I'll build it here. Next to this river. Um, be an easy way to get back and forward about the place. That's a new feature to 1.8 as well. Um, they've added in rivers and ravines. Um, the rivers run through most of the biomes now um, rather than just wee ponds and lakes. And ravines are huge, huge, huge big gaps in the ground that look similar, similar to the Grand Canyon to be honest. Um, they run through just about anywhere. Um, hopefully we'll find one of those later on so I can show you. Um, they're always fun. And Okay, so we shall craft some sticks, and with my sticks, I shall make a pick, and an axe, oops, and I'll also make a shovel, um, because I can never be bothered digging by hand, um, it's always a pain. Okay, see if we can find... No, 
Um, actually, before I go and try and find some coal, I'll put up a quick shelter. A wooden shelter. Uh, we'll just do it here. I seem to be lagging a little bit, so I'll see what I can do about that in a second. Um, yeah, this is never going to be enough wood for this. Um, I made it too big, I think. I'll just make a wee square at the moment. Or a rectangle, rather. And I'll come back to there. Uh, do, 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 do. Okay, I'll have to find some coal and some stone to get some better tools. Uh, we'll head off in this way, it looks quite promising. Um, also new to 1.8, um, as you've probably noticed already, is these vines. Uh, they're a bit useless, you can't really do much with them. Um, other than they fall off under whatever you hit. Uh, and there's mushrooms here as well, they spawn all over the, the new swamp biome. Um, which is what this is. Uh, oh, there's some mountains. Oh, and I've just fallen down a hole. Um, a nice wee cave there. Goes all the way down. Uh, I think that may actually be a mini ravine. Uh, by the looks of it. I don't know. We'll explore it later. Um, not nearly equipped enough to face the dark, damp underworlds of Minecraft. Creepers at night are terrifying enough. Um, oh, I see some coal up there. It's pretty high up though. Um, see if I can get to it. This is still the river. As you can see, it's pretty long. It um, goes all the way out there into the open water. Um, the sea, and maybe we'll find out where the other end leads uh, at some point. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo, here we are. See if we can find some coal near the bottom. There we go. Perfect. Oh, there's quite a lot up there, actually. Uh, I collect this and then I'll go up. Um, is that a cave up there or is that just a strangely placed shadow? I think it may just be a strangely placed shadow. Hmm. So maybe all the bugs aren't fixed. Get it sorted, Notch! Uh, so I'll collect some coal. Oh, there's actually quite a lot here. I don't think I'll need to go up there at the moment. Um, and then we'll collect some stone, make some better tools, and maybe actually I can collect enough stone to build a better house. Um, because most of the time when I build houses made out of wood, I end up burning them down, which is always fun. I suppose. Um, collecting some stone. Collecting stone. Um, apparently, um, they've changed the strongholds. The strongholds are huge, big stone structures that go underground and stuff. Um, apparently, there's some good treasure and stuff at the end. Um, they used to only spawn once per world uh, in the pre-releases, but apparently they've changed them so they can spawn three per world, um, making them a little bit more common, a um, little bit easier to find because no one was able to find one in the pre-release games. Um, so hopefully we'll be able to come across one of them. And there's also abandoned mine shafts. Um, we'll see them at some point as well, they're fairly common. Uh, and obviously there's the new Endermen mobs, which are absolutely terrifying. Uh, and hopefully we'll see some of them when it turns to night. Uh, that'll do for stone at the moment, I think. Um, so we'll head back now, and I shall collect that sugar cane on the way. Um, Oh, got it. Um, I'm trying to think what else has been added here that I could tell you about. Um, I mean, most of you probably already know this stuff anyway, and you'll be thinking, "Shut up, Chris! We already know. Just got on with the game." Um, so, no, I can't think of anything else at the moment. Uh, 
And where the hell did my house go? Um, is, is it over here? Aha! There we are. There we go. There we go. Uh, have a wee look at the time of day. It's quite late in the afternoon. Um, do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to bring this up into my house so I can build it from the inside. And that way I don't get killed. Uh, I haven't decided which way I'm going to put the door yet. I'll probably put it that way. Um, or maybe that. Yeah, the other way. I'll do it here. And as for why I'm putting stone on top of wood, well, have you ever seen it before? Nah, I haven't. Um, it's usually the other way around, so... Fuck it, let's try something new! Uh, oh, also, another thing um, you may have noticed is my, the hunger bar down here. Um, that decreases over time when you sprint. Oh, shit. When you sprint and when you're generally just messing about. When it's full, you will regenerate hearts. Um, don't know how quickly. It's reasonably slow, actually, so you can still die fairly easy. Um, it does not make you immortal, so don't go running off and fighting any creepers. Um, yeah, and when it goes down to empty, the hunger bar, that is, um, you start losing life. Um, it's interesting. Uh, I've never seen it go below half a heart, but it doesn't get any higher either because food now just repl replenishes the hunger bar and doesn't actually replenish your life. Which, yeah, is a pretty cool idea, but it's a bit of a pain when you're in a dungeon or in a cave and you're being attacked by just about everything under the sun. Uh, ah, it's getting fairly dark now, so I better hurry up with us. Hey guys, um, there's a wee bit of problem there with the camera. Uh, it kind of cut off a wee bit, um, so while I was waiting and getting it back up, I put a roof on the house and added some torches and a little door. Uh, something else that's quite interesting is there's a creeper right outside the door. So I'm going to see if I can kill him, uh, and then we're going to have to call it quits for today because I'm needing my time limit. Uh, here we go. Oh, don't you dare blow my house up. Don't you dare. You have got to be kidding me. Oh, for Christ's sake. And now there is a huge hole in the side of my house. Ah, oh, that is the worst idea I've ever had. Um... <laughs> Fantastic. Okay, well, I'm going to go ahead and try and fix that. Um, and I'll see you next time, I suppose. Um, I've been Apollo Fox. Uh, thanks for watching my first ever Let's Play. Um, I'll try and get the next one posted up as soon as possible. But, uh, thanks for watching. Um, fuck. <laughs>